Hello, I'm Allie Cook of Dentistry Today, and we are here at the Greater New York Dental Meeting. I'm at the Bisco booth with Dr. Doug Brown. Dr. Brown, it's nice to meet you. Hi, how are you? Excellent. Uh, what product do you have to showcase today? We're going to be launching, or Bisco is, is, is proud to launch, um, Dentistry's first resin-modified calcium silicate. What that is, it is a light curable flowable that's infused with calcium silicates. And this is very, very special to um, dentistry. You know, as a clinician, um, we're all about protecting vital pulps. And we understand so much more about wound healing nowadays, uh, understanding that in order to, you know, whenever you, you go into a tooth and, and, and then repair it, um, that is an open wound. And um, understanding that there are, there are special qualities of a material that aid in that wound healing, and, that, and one of those is sustained alkalinity. The material must be able to be placed right over that affected dentin or um, a uh, pulp cap area um, and then deep dentin so as to be self-sealing, um, antimicrobial, but most importantly, the rapid calcium release. In the deep dentin, fluoride doesn't matter there. It's about calcium release. And the calcium release is what changes dentin pulp cells and dentin serum, that, that fluid around collagen, to form appetite. Calcium silicates, we've, we in dentistry, we've been using them for a long, long time in, in calcium hydroxide, or else the MTA materials of the, um, of the pro roots and things like that. Um, because of these qualities, Theracal is really special because it, these calcium silicates, these active ingredients of, of appetite stimulating, are infused within a light curable flowable resin. We, we haven't had this to this point, now we do. How, um, you know, our, I mean, currently, um, we either, either use resin modified glass ionomers mm -hmm. uh, or calcium hydroxide in, in uh, really deep areas. However, those materials, they were the best things that we had up to this point. Calcium hydroxide is, is um, very soluble. Uh, we all understand that. Uh, MTA materials, they are, they are self-cure and they take a long, long time to set up. Resin modified glass ionomer is very acidic. Resin modified glass ionomer, all these materials aren't meant for that deep dentin um, that uh, as a protective liner um, and, uh, and then added incrementally to a base standpoint. And we've never had one material that we can use for direct pulp capping, indirect pulp capping, appetite stimulation, um, revitalizing deep, and it's the security blanket for the vital pulp. And, and that is so important to us as a clinician. That's great. Sounds very unique. Um, can you show us a little bit about sure. how it works? Oh, and you know, and there is there is no triturating, there is no clicking, there's no mixing. It's just a simple application out, out of a flowable syringe that we use every day. And on the deep dentin, pulp caps, um, even uh, you know class B, class C depths. This is a, a, a is very radiopaque, 2.5 radio opacity, um, immediate self sealing. You can see it. You can light cure it 20 seconds um, at a one millimeter increments and then bond right over top of it. The other beauty of this, this material, unlike a resin modified glass ionomer, if you are using it in an indirect situation before you take an impression, and, and all the time, you know, when you take an impression, sometimes the, the materials come out with the impression or whatever. You can bond this special Theracal in, so put your bonding agent down, then put Theracal over top of it with no diminishing of the calcium release through the bonding agent. We've done it both with, we've shown it with, with Allbond SE and Allbond 3. Um, so this is pretty I mean, unique in that if I need, if I'm cutting a uh, crown prep, and the composite flies out of there in a class 5 or else a class 3, I can bond Theracal in and continue on with my, my prep. Pretty special material. This is, obviously you can tell that I'm very, and Bisco's very excited about, about this material, but I think that, and I know, dentistry needs this material, and once they get it in their, their hands, come on over to the Bisco booth, try it out, ask the questions we have years of, of um, data, you know, s support for this area, I mean, um, for these calcium silicate products. We've been using them forever and ever with the calcium hydroxide. Now, this has physical properties that we can place under amalgam, we can place under composite, pretty special. 
Excellent. Well, here we are at Bisco. You heard it all here. And where can people go for more information about this? At the Bisco Dental Booth. And I'm not sure what the number is. What's the number here, guys? 1601. 1601. <laughs> Come to 1601 or else Bisco.com. Okay. We are a direct supplier. Excellent. Dr. Brown, thank you so much. Thank you. And once again, for more information on this and other events at the Greater New York Dental Meeting, you can always visit our website at DentistryToday.com. Thank you.